Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a brand new video. So today's video is a Primark haul again. I am super excited as always to film this video for you guys because I popped into Primark and picked up quite a few really, really nice bits and I just know that you are going to love this haul. So I actually popped in for reference to the Bristol Primark. I was actually impressed with the stuff that was in there but i will say if you are planning on going into bristol primark um the stock is quite low i found that the sizing range wasn't great and i actually struggled to find a lot of stuff in my size but i did just size up with the stuff that I couldn't get in my size. So I'm gonna show you everything that I got and I'm just gonna get straight into it. If you do enjoy this video, don't forget to click the like button. Also subscribe if you're new. If you're new here, hi, welcome. My name's Sophie and I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday and I would love for you guys to stick around if you do enjoy this video, it would mean so, so much. And yes, we're gonna jump into this video and I really hope you enjoy it. I'm gonna start with like the little things first and then work my way up to the clothes So the first thing that I picked up is a makeup product and it is the perfect finish foundation It says it's medium to full coverage Natural finish and it's got moisturizing vitamin E. This is the packaging What drew me to this is that it actually looks like the foundation that I normally use I'll actually get it because I've just used it now and um, but the packaging looks so similar so I use the Maybelline fit me foundation um, It's just this one here and that's the Primark one See what I mean? So I was drawn to this one because I absolutely love the Fit Me foundation and I have a feeling it's going to be a dupe of that. I have also got coming up a video where I do a full face of Primark makeup so don't forget to subscribe if you do want to see that but I'm going to use that in this video and test it and let you guys know what I think of it. It only costs £2.50 which I think is so good. Um, and I got it in the shade Nude Beige, which is 03. Um, so I'm hoping that it's going to be the right shade because I don't have a clue. <laughs> but yeah, I thought for £2.50, you can't go wrong. And I'm really looking forward to trying this and seeing if it's any good. Because I actually do use a lot of Primark makeup for like my everyday makeup routines. So I actually am a big fan of Primark makeup and I think it's really underrated. So yeah, looking forward to trying this. Next thing I then picked up is this gorgeous planner that just says planner 2021 and it's in this gorgeous baby pink colour with the gold spine and I just think that that is so so stunning. As you guys know if you have watched my videos before and you are subscribed to my channel I like to be really organised and I just love stationery so I saw this actually my sister saw it and she pointed it out to me because she knew that I'd love it and I did love it so I picked it up it only costs £3.50 on the inside you've got enjoy today top goals which is great because I love to set goals um, then you've got my plan so there's a whole list here where you can write out your plan and then it says make a note um, so that's just a little box where you can make notes and then there's just like a lined page so you can literally just write whatever you like. So you could even use it as maybe like a diary, do you know what I mean? So if you guys write diary entries then you could use that page for a diary entry. I mean I used to keep a diary and I used to definitely go over one page. But if you are just a short and sweet kind of person that would be really great. But yeah I just thought for £3.50 it was so cute and it's just so pretty. I'm just obsessed. I then picked up a couple of items of homeware. As you guys know, I am obsessed with Primark homeware at the moment. It is just so good and I really could have gone crazy in there, but I I feel like I need to put myself on a little bit of a spending ban. But I picked up the first item which was this coconut diffuser. These are only 80p so good and they have so many different scents in Primark at the moment but I thought I'd go for a really summery scent because I was just feeling like buying coconut I absolutely love the scent of coconut it is just one of my favorite scents um and for 80p you literally can't go wrong so really looking forward to seeing what this smells like I'm actually going to do a live smell test I think 
okay um i'm not gonna lie to you guys i don't like it no 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 um i'm not gonna recommend that to you everybody because it actually smells like chemicals no that's why it's atp i don't recommend please do not get that this item i then picked up is this gorgeous pressed flowers frame and it is so stunning i am obsessed with pampas grass there is pampas in every single room of my house and i just really like it i don't know why i really like the aesthetic of it i really like the look of it and the color and i just really like how pampas grass looks in my house so i saw this and i am obsessed with gold as well so the gold frame and the gold chain just drew me to this and i absolutely love the fact that there are pressed pampas grass in the frame this cost six pounds which i actually thought was really good because it does look really expensive it looks more high quality than you would think from the price it actually does feel really sturdy and i'm thinking about putting this maybe somewhere in the dressing room or maybe in the bathroom i'm not really sure yet but i just couldn't leave this guy behind it is just so pretty and i thought it was going to look really nice in the house so i just thought i would pick it up look how cute that is i'm just so impressed i then picked up some new tea towels for the kitchen we are doing a complete re not redesign but we are just changing up the colors in the kitchen at the moment so before we had like black appliances but we are now going for more neutral we're going to change it up to like whites and like a boho kind of theme like with the bamboo and stuff because that is the kind of way that our house is going and um, so i needed to buy some new tea towels because our ones are black to match the appliances and um, so i thought i would go for a bit more neutral so i've gone for gray and whites i just thought that these were really good because they're three pounds and there are four tea towels in here which i thought was really great and they actually feel really good quality as well so i'm going to pop these in the kitchen i just think that they're really nice and you can't go wrong for three pounds and then the final bit of homeware that i picked up from primark is this cushion i am literally obsessed with cushions i can't stop buying them i literally don't know what it is about them but i can't stop buying them if you guys saw my last primark haul i did pick up two cushions for the bedroom and i was honestly obsessed with them they are so lovely they look so beautiful on the bed and primark have like a really scandinavian boho vibe going on which i am here for i absolutely love the scandinavian kind of style so i picked up this because again it's kind of scandinavian style it is neutral and i think i'm either going to pop one of these on the sofa because we are actually changing our cushions on our sofa at the moment while well, we're going to buy some soon and um, so this might go on the sofa but it might also go on the bed um, just as one of the feature cushions at the front i thought for seven pounds this was so good and i cannot express to you how many beautiful cushions primark had in i could have bought so many but i have bought a lot of cushions recently so i needed to restrict myself um, but i thought i just couldn't leave this one behind and i absolutely love it i really like the long cushion so i'm really happy with this and i think it's going to look really lovely either on the bed or the sofa moving on to the clothing i'm going to show you a lingerie set first and again if you saw my last primark haul you would have seen a very similar one it actually is the same style but a different color so i picked up a pink lingerie set in the last primark haul and they have it in this gorgeous yellow color i am obsessed I think this is so beautiful for spring and summer with a tan and I absolutely love this set. The pink one, I haven't tried on this one yet, but the pink one is stunning and I felt really confident in it. I loved the look of it. It's really flattering and I just think that it is a beautiful set. These cost £5. £5 
flipping pounds and they are so worth the money i am so happy with these and i'm really happy that i managed to get my hands on this yellow color it's like a lemon yellow um it's gonna look really pretty on really fitting for spring and summer the actual quality of it is really good obviously it is meant to be like sheer and quite delicate so you have to be careful but um, the quality itself feels really really lovely and it's got an underwire as well so it's really supportive and I absolutely love the pink one so I know that I'm going to love this one and it's just gorgeous I'm so happy of it. I then picked up some new leggings. I am obsessed with Primark leggings. They are so comfortable, such good quality, and they're actually the only pair of leggings that I've ever worn that I find actually are long enough for my legs. I am quite tall, I'm five foot seven, so yeah, I find it really difficult to find things for the bottom that are right lengthwise like i really don't like short bottoms so i picked up another pair of the primark leggings because i already have a pair but i wanted another one just for an extra pair of leggings they only cost five pounds which i think is fab because they are such good quality so comfortable i actually think that they have fleece lining oh these ones don't have fleece lining but the ones that I'm currently wearing are also from Primark and they have fleece lining. Maybe I got a different pair, but they are like very similar material. I'm hoping I bought the right ones now, but I really like Primark leggings regardless. So I'm really happy with these. As I said, they only cost five pounds. I got these in a small and they fit perfectly. I love Primark leggings and I just think for the price, you can't go wrong. I then picked up another pair of leggings. Now, I've had a little bit of a boo-boo with this one and I have noticed that some of the stuff that I picked up, I thought I'd picked up a different size to what I actually have. You know those really annoying trips to Primark where you look at the hanger and it has the size that you want and then you get home and realise that the tag says a different size? That's happened to me. Um, these leggings are gorgeous and I actually saw them in Primark and thought oh my god how are these in Primark because they look like H&M quality and I've actually been looking for a pair of leggings like this for a while so I'm really sad that the size isn't what I thought it was because they are too big for me so I'm gonna have to go back and see if my local Primark have these stocked because I just want to swap the size but these are some nude leggings that are ribbed and they feel so comfortable they feel like such good quality they're actually really thick and I love this style of legging so they're really long as well so I know that they're going to fit me lengthwise and I have had to try these on already because I wanted to see if I could keep them um, and I definitely can't because they're actually in a large and they're too big for me so I'm really sad about that I thought I picked up a medium they didn't actually have any small in the Primark that I saw them in these had very limited stock but I just think that they are absolutely beautiful. Really like these for spring. And I actually don't own a pair of leggings of this colour, which is why I wanted to pick up a pair in this colour. And you guys know I just love neutral colours. So yeah, picked up these. I'm still going to do a try-on clip for you. They are big, which you'll see in the try-on clip. But I'm still going to show you anyway, in case any of you do want to pick them up yourselves, if you do see them in store. They cost £7, so they are a bit more expensive than like the standard leggings in Primark, but they definitely feel thicker. So um, obviously you get a bit better quality, so obviously a bit more expensive. So everybody, these are the nude leggings, and I'm just going to try and make them look as good as possible, because they are very big because obviously I didn't get these in the right size so I really wish that these were smaller because they are falling down a little bit but I absolutely love these they are so comfortable so comfortable and I just put it on with a hoodie just to show you like the actual leg area because the leg area itself isn't actually too bad but it's just the waist area but yeah this is what they look like they are a stunning color I'm really gutted that these aren't the right size I'm going to go back and hopefully they'll have some in my local. But I think that they are so pretty. I actually love 
nude leggings. I'm actually super happy with the colour. I just, I can't recommend these enough. They're actually so nice and they look very H&M like. So I definitely recommend if you do see these in. I feel like if it was the right size, they would be really comfy around the waist as well because I feel like this bit is meant to be elasticated. But obviously if it was tighter, it would look great. And I actually feel like it would be really flattering as well. They look so nice and they're really thick, the quality is great, and I think for seven pounds, these are fab. a new pair of jeans now a very similar situation i actually thought that i'd picked up a 12 but i picked up a 10 so they don't fit they do not fit at all you always have to size up in primark which i know but on the actual um hanger it did say a 12 but i've got home and they are a 10 which i'm really really sad about but they are just a black pair of mum jeans and it says they are high-waisted. I absolutely love the style of mum jeans. I think that they are so lovely and I really find that Primark mum jeans are just the best mum jeans I've ever worn. I actually do own a blue pair as well and they have like rips in them and they are so nice but they are quite old now. So I needed to pick up some new ones and I wanted a pair of black but sadly these just don't fit. So I'm going to go back and again have to swap the size but these cost 15 pounds as i said these ones are a 10 but i'm not going to be showing you a try on clip because i literally can't get them over my bum but take my word for it primark mum jeans are just the best and i absolutely love them and i'm just so sad that these don't fit um but oh well we will go back and swap the size and everything will be okay the thing i then picked up is actually something that I would never have seen myself buying and I just went a little bit outside of my comfort zone but I thought that these were so nice like so nice and they are a pair of leather look shorts in this brown colour I just would never have seen myself buying anything like this but this year I have decided I'm going to push myself out of my comfort zone wear things that I probably wouldn't necessarily have picked before and I saw these and I just thought I wouldn't wear those normally, but I love them, so I'm just going to buy them. Do you know what I mean? And I thought that these would look really nice in the summer, also like on holiday, if we do get to go on holiday. I got these in a size 14 because they didn't actually have any 12s, but I thought as well, with leather, they might come up small. So I'm actually really glad that I picked up a 14. We'll see how these fit um, in the try on clip. But I just think that they are beautiful. I really, really love these. And I thought that it would look really nice with a nice white top and some sandals. I just think they're so nice. And they definitely look higher quality than Primark. Okay, guys. So these are the shorts. And I love them so much. I think although they are a leather material, they're actually really comfortable and I'm actually quite glad that I've got them in a 14 because they are quite baggy around here, which I really like. I don't like when like leather is really tight fitting um, and they're actually really comfy. I mean, to be fair, if they had a 12, that would have been great because they are slightly big around the waist but they're not going to fall down so i actually don't mind and i find them really comfortable so i'm actually really happy with the sizing of these and i just think that they are going to look really lovely in the summer and also spring as well when it starts to get quite warm i mean we've had a few warm days but <laughs> not anything to be wearing shorts all the time so yeah i really actually love these i love the fact that you can pair it with white and it looks really lovely and i think with some sand Sandals, these would look nice also some like flat dolly shoes maybe or even just like my i've got a pair of white bands so i might wear those with these as well and i just feel like you could actually pair this with anything it would also look nice on like a night out outfit um so you could wear these for a lot of things so i'm super happy with them and i think for i think i said these were 10 pounds i think that that is great
I then picked up just a little cami top. I absolutely love these cami tops from Primark because they are just so cheap and cheerful. And I really like the ones with the spaghetti um, straps because I just find that these are so comfortable. I already have one in a nude color and I absolutely love it. I wear it all the time. So I wanted to pick up a white one and I think that these are so good for, I think they're three pounds. Yes, they're £3. I got this in a size small and yeah, I absolutely love them. You just can't go wrong with these. Next thing I'm about to show you, I know that you are going to die for because I absolutely love it. I can't believe that this is from Primark and I am just so chuffed with how nice this is. So I'm going to show you a loungewear set. I got a pair of joggers and I got the jumper and I'm just so super happy that I got my hands on this. Are you ready? So this is the jumper. Oh my God, the colour. The colour is stunning. I'm so happy with this. Obviously it's like this baby blue colour. I am obsessed with the collar as well it's a high collar and it's ribbed and i am just so obsessed with this this is what it looks like from the front and then the back has like these line details which i just absolutely love i'm so so happy with this i actually had to get this in an i think it's a 2xl because they didn't have any other sizes but i was just like you know what they've got my size in the joggers i'm getting the jumper so i got a 2xl i actually do normally size up in jumpers and hoodies anyway because i really like the slouchy oversized fit so i didn't care that it was 2xl and this was 10 pounds which i think is so good it feels such good quality like it's thick i'm pretty sure it's fleece lining let me just have a look fleece lining you guys know i love a fleece lining and i just think that this color for spring is beautiful so nice and these are the joggers so again in the same color they match and they've got pockets they have a drawstring waist which is great because you can pull it in as tight as you like and it has cuffed bottoms this is just a loungewear set of dreams i just can't believe that this is from primark again they have fleece lining in the um insides and i got the bottoms in a size small and they were 10 pounds as well so this loungewear set in total cost 20 pounds which i think is so good it feels so comfortable really good quality and the color is just my favorite it's just so gorgeous and i can't wait to show you this on right everyone i feel like this needs a special introduction i'm sorry can we just take a minute can we just take a minute of silence please i cannot express to you how much i love this this is my new favorite loungewear set Everything about this loungewear set I am obsessed with. I love this collar. I really like it. Um, I feel like, although this top is a 2XL, it's not really a 2XL. Do you know what I mean? So I definitely feel like you can size up. Um, the joggers fit perfectly. I got these, as I said, in a size small and I am normally a UK 10 to 12. So these fit so nicely. They're not see-through, which is great. They feel really thick. They're comfy. They're fleece lining. They've got pockets, which I love. And I just couldn't love anything more if I tried. For £20, this is a bargain. Next thing I then picked 
up is a pajama top. I've actually been restricting myself with pajamas recently because I have got so many and I am obsessed with Primark pajamas, so I have just got a whole drawer full of them. But I couldn't leave this behind. I couldn't. And I really wish that you could feel this because it is the softest thing I have ever felt. I actually debated whether I needed this and I nearly didn't buy it, but I kept thinking about it the whole time. So I went back and I put it in my basket because I just couldn't leave it. And it is this gorgeous top. I've got this in an XL, I think, because I wanted it to be super oversized. And it's just a Disney one. It is a thumper. It's a thumper pajama top that is the softest material ever, ever. I'm telling you now, if you see this in Primark, please pick it up. You will not regret it. I cannot wait to lounge around in this tonight. And it just says, Walt Disney thumper, if you can't, what does that say? If you cannot say anything nice, then do not say anything at all. Which is so relevant at the moment because I've had a few horrible comments recently and I just think, what is the point in being mean? If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say it at all. And I absolutely love Disney's Thumper. I just think he's so cute. So yeah, really happy of this. I just can't wait to just snuggle on down in this because it is so soft. It is so soft, everybody. And this cost £10, which is a little bit pricey for the top, but I think it's so worth it. This is the cutest thing ever. I am so comfortable. I've just paired it with a little pair of pyjama shorts, which I also got from Primark in my last haul. Um, these are also so comfy. But this top is the softest thing I've ever put on my body. I absolutely love like the velvet feeling of Primark pajamas. If you guys have seen, they actually do like a set of pajama bottoms and like a top like this in like loads of different colors. And around Christmas time, I picked up so many sets of them and they cost like 14 pounds and they are the same material as this, but this just feels quite a bit softer than those but they are still like a velvet material they are so nice and just imagine that times like 10 and that is this top i literally am so happy with this it's so cute it's so cozy i just love it i'm so obsessed that I picked up from Primark are a pair of high heels. I, again, love the high heels from Primark. I feel like I just love everything in Primark, um, but I always like to pick up a new pair of heels in there, and I haven't for a while, actually. So, now that everything is opening up again, I thought I'll pick up a new pair of high heels, and they are really beautiful. They are just a nude pair of mules. They're not too high, because I am quite tall, so I don't want to be, like, seven foot, you know what I mean? So, they are, like, a small heel, and they have, like, this crochet style on the front. Is it crochet? I think it is. I'm not entirely sure, but you can get what I mean from the pattern on the front. And I got these in a size 6, and they are just so nice. I'm just so happy with these. And they only cost £14, which I do find to be the standard price for heels in Primark. And I think that that is a really good price, considering that they actually feel really good quality. So yeah, really excited to wear these out. So that is the end of my Primark haul, everybody. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to click the like button and also subscribe if you're new. I am going to be doing, as I said at the start of the video, a full face of Primark makeup and testing. So if you do want to see that, again, don't forget to subscribe and also comment down below. I really hope you guys have had an amazing weekend. I really really hope you have a great week and I'll see you in the next video on Wednesday. Love you all. Bye.